and local singer-songwriter Derek Michael Mark joins me to celebrate Grammy Week here on CBS. Welcome. Thank you, Christy. Nice to meet you. Nice to be here. Now, at what age did you start singing and, and writing songs? Uh, very young. I was brought up with a musical family, and we. Uh, my dad's a drummer. My mom's a singer. Uh, I started playing drums. I remember having. That's where I started was drums, and I remember having to reteach myself how to play once I was tall enough to reach the bass pedal. <laughs> so it was, uh, it was very young. My whole life I've been around music. Yeah. And do you mind if I ask how old you are? I'm 26. 26. 26 and a week from, uh, week from today. Oh, actually. nice. Well, yes. happy birthday yes. to you. Yes. So you feel, though, like you were born with the blues and, and rock soul. Yeah, I was uh, kind of uh, out of my generation of what the trend was going through growing up school and what I was listening to was a lot of my parents' music uh, and even some of the stuff before that. I got introduced with rock and roll and then I, I liked rock and roll so much that it was, uh, you know, where does this come from? And that's what brought me to the blues. Mm -hmm. And so I'm really a big fan of the rock, soul, blues type feeling music. Who influences you? Who do you like to listen to? Um, vocally, probably Brian Duncan. He's uh, he's a actually a Christian rock artist, mm -hmm. and his vocals are just incredible. His his the way he pers puts himself out, the way his vocal ability is, it's incredible. Uh, musically, probably Eric Clapton yeah. would be one of the tops for me. Mm -hmm. um, Stevie Ray Vaughan, things like that. Johnny yeah. Lang, who I got introduced mm -hmm. to when I was younger, and he was young as well. So uh, very much the rock soul blues kind of rhythm mm -hmm. and blues stuff is more what I feel my heart's more partial to. Yeah. Even though it's not exactly what the trend is, you know, in today's music world. Uh, <laughs> that music will always be in. I don't know it what you're will. talking about. It, it will. You can't, you can't kill what created it. That's you right. Know, pretty much. Yeah, that's right. So Johnny Lang, he was kind of a phenom. I mean, he, he was, was a young guy. So does that give you hope that that even though you're young in age, you've got the skills, you've got the chops, and, and you can get there. I, I do. Uh, you know, Johnny Lang, Joe Bonamassa, a couple of young blues, uh, rock and roll blues guys that are just phenom they're just phenomenal. They're, they're very unrecognized for how much talent they have. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, Johnny Lang was 15 and a half, I think, when he recorded the Lie to Me album, and I was like 12. Yeah. So it was like, wow, this kid's only a few years older than me and he's doing this. This is so cool. It was That's a big right. inspiration for me. That's right. And you're going to play a song for us. I what am. are you going to play? I'm going to play a song that I wrote not too long ago. It's uh, called, titled it, Wandering Wonder. Okay. Sometimes I wonder been like without her she treats me so mean but you know no she doesn't see no use me when you want to when you carry heavy load use me and abuse me like you did before use me when you want to when you carry heavy load Like it did before Like it did before mm. Seeing her out With some other guy Never reason, no You know it makes me wonder why One day she's here Next she's gone Left my mind to wander all alone. Use me when you want to, when you carry heavy load. Use me and abuse me like you did before. Use me when you want to, when you carry heavy load. Use me and abuse me like you did before. Nice. Yeah. 
Well, that woman, she done you wrong. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> she did. <laughs> and, but, don't, but, but this greatest song has come out of something that the songwriter has experienced, they right? They do. They do. And my feeling with that song is kind of more of a rock, uh, soul type melody, mm -hmm. but lyrics of what an old blues guy would write. Yeah. You know? Uh, something that's simple yet still appeals to people in in a whole, mm -hmm. you know, as as a whole yeah. rather. It's mm -hmm. it's ple it's a pleasure to uh, you know, just kind of stumble across these kind of things yeah. when I'm playing. You yeah, know. I understand. Um, where are you playing around Central Oregon? Where can we find you? Lots of places. Uh, yeah. Northside Bar and Grill is I'm frequently at the Northside Bar and Grill. Kelly D's uh, Irish Sports Pub, Checkers and Redmond. Uh, a new new venue that just opened up off a of Third Street called Eco. It's a bar and a bistro, and I do the acoustic thing there. Nice. Um, many many different places, especially in the summertime, as we get to the, oh, yeah. the festivals and people having their weddings and their mm -hmm. private parties and stuff. Nice. Uh, pretty much every venue that has live music, you might you just might see me pop my head in Fantastic. one time or another. Well, don't be don't be surprised if we start to stalk you. So I'm just <laughs> that's I'm okay. Today. Facebook and my website. Uh, that's and right. Can you can keep up on where my calendar, what I'm doing with my calendar, and Excellent. what things are happening, what things might happen, and yeah. what has already happened. Fantastic. Well, Derek, it was <laughs> nice to meet you. Thank you very much, Christy. Thank, Thank you for having me. It's Thank a pleasure you. to be here. Pleasure to have yeah. you. Thank you. We'll be right back. Thank you.